वंदे गुरुपद्वंदम भक्तबिंदसमित श्रीचैतन्य प्रभु वंदे निंदसहोदित श्रीनंदनंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोद गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदाबनम मनोहर बांशाकतरु वश के पासीदिव्यवच पति पावनेभ्य वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुकोति वाचा लंग पंगुंगलंगयतिगिरी यत्कि पातमहंग वंदे परमाधव बृंदावई तुलसीदेवी पिया वै केशव स्नभक्ति पदे देवी सत्वत् नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरच नरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीपत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरुभक्ति भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदर धेय सदा परिभवनमीष्टदोहम तीर्थास्पद शिव विरचनुत शरण्यम भीतात्म वनतपाल भवादीपूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरणारिंद यत्दपल्लवन चंदमि छटाया विस्फुर्जीत किमी गोपवधुष्वदर्शि पूर्णागरसागर सारमूर्ति साराधि कामयि कदा काम कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनिंद शिवादगदाधर शिवासादी गौरभक्तबिंद श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनिंद शिवादत गदाधर शिवासादी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनुका बुदा तो संकर्तन कपितरो कमलायुताक्षु भीषाबर द्विजर जुगधर्म पाल वंदे जगत्प्रियक करुणाभतार हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनुका बुदा तो संकर्तन कपितरो कमलायताक्ष विशाबर द्विजर जुगधर्म पाल वंदे जगत प्रियक करुणा भतार हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नमा गंगे तब पाद पंकज सुरासुरवंद दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दासी नित्यम भावान्ूपेन्न सदा नरानम गंगा तरंगरमणीय जटा कलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषी तो बाम भागम नारायण प्रियमनंग मदापहारम वाराणसीपुरपति भज विशनाथ बागीशजुष्वदने लक्ष्मीजस् च वक्षसी जैस्ते हृदय संबी 
ಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಸಂಸಾರ ಸಿಂಧುತ್ತರನೆ ಹೃದಯ ಜದೀಶಾದ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನಾಮೃತರಸೆ ರಮತೆ ಮನುಶ್ಚೇತ್ ಪ್ರೇಮಾಂಬುಧೋ ವಿಹರಣೆ ಯದಿ ಚಿತ್ತಬೀತಿ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಚಂದಚರಣೆ ಕುರುತಾನುರಾಗ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಚಂದಚರಣೆ ಕುರುತಾನುರಾಗ ಸಂಸಾರ ಸಿಂಧು ಉತ್ತರಣೆ ಹೃದಯ ಯದೀಶಾದ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನಾಮೃತರಸೆ ರಮತೆ ಮನುಶ್ಚೇತ್ ಪ್ರೇಮಾಂಬುಧೋ ವಿಹರಣೆ ಯದಿ ಚಿತ್ತಬೀತಿ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಚಂದಚರಣೆ ಕುರುತಾನುರಾಗ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಚಂದಚರಣೆ ಕುರುತಾನುರಾಗ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠಿಪತಿ ಶ್ರೀ ಶೀಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಠಾಕುರ್ ಪ್ರಭುಪಾದ ಪರಮಂಶ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಭಗವತ್ ಕೀಪಾ can not come directly to us bhagavad gita can come to us through tat shakti tat prakash etc tat shakti tat prakash etc gauriya goshtipati sri sila bhakti siddhant saraswati goshtami thakur pohpal paramahansa jagat guru told bhagavad kripa can not come to bonded soul directly it is not possible bhagavad kipa can, can come to us through tat shakti tat prakash etc if we cannot understand actually bonded soul cannot get any inspiration actually bonded soul cannot get any inspiration in bhajan if cannot see one you know firing example in front of him or her bonded soul cannot get any inspiration in bhajan always feel weak don't like to do what to do forcefully doing because bonded soul cannot get any inspiration in bhajan if bonded soul can give a firing example in front of him then can get some inspiration that is the main point now point is that many time i told those who are holding the flag of bhagavad dharma those who are going to claim that we are following chaitanya mahaprabhu in toto what is the standard what is the standard who can pass remark that he is a, you know firing example he is not who can pass remark that is the main problem anybody can claim like you can go to that side of river all sahajias they claim that we are following chaitanya mahaprabhu you are also following that you are following chaitanya mahaprabhu i am also for going to say i am following chaitanya mahaprabhu but who can pass remark that is the main question that is why our guru varg speaking that is our our guru varg speaking that you can see one example said by shila sarup gosai your authenticity your authenticity your behavior your behavior your authenticity everything should be approved by sarab gosai follow what i mean to say whole world can give vote to you you are a great acharya you are so great but what it concern to us 
those who are following Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur. What it concerns to us? We like to, we like to see the example of Sarup Gosai. Like you know, if you are going to bring some gold in front of goldsmith, you know, you bring some gold. Goldsmith, what can do? Have some stone, special to stone. The gold, you know, the gold you bring, you can rub. There is so many procedure of testing. First of all, rubbing. You can watch, can understand this is the grade of the gold. This is the quality. After that, ductility of gold. Ductility means it is physics. It is physics term. Gold is such a metal. If you go on beating, 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 so much, so fine foil you can make, but still cannot break. It's called ductility in physics. Another point, if you burn the gold, if you go on burning the gold, the gold can show the quality. Follow. This is the procedure through which you can understand the quality of gold. This way, all your behavior, all your character, all your behavior, all your Siddhanta Vichar, everything should be approved by Sarup Goshai. Then Popat can approve. Popat, Bhaktivinu Thakur, in fact, in fact, they are yardstick, in fact, the yardstick set by Siman Mahaprabhu, we must follow. The yardstick said by Mahaprabhu, we must follow. Because Mahaprabhu already told to Saurav Gosai, while Gundicha Manjan Lila going, I am not going to so much discuss, so big you know, discussion today, vast topics. While Gondicha Mandir, Manjan cleaning Lila going on, one Gauriya devotee, Brahman, very simple hearted, is coming with a pot of water pitcher and throw this water into the lotus feet of Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu showing angry Lila. Why? Because Mahaprabhu is going to set the example now. Inside temple, one should not wash the lotus feet of anybody. But that Brahman has done okay because he is Jagannath himself. But still, Mahaprabhu expressing the Leela, this kind of Leela, and calling, where is Sarup? He calls Sarup. Sarup, you come. What happens, Prabhu? You see, your Gauriya, your Gauriya, be careful, your Gauriya. Tomar Gauriya Kare Atek Phaiyati. Your Gauriya, you know, doing this kind of activities. That's mean Mahaprabhu wanted to indicate. That's mean Mahaprabhu wanted to indicate Sarup Gosai that you are the overall in charge of whole Gauriya society. You are the overall in charge of whole Gauriya society. Nobody can, you know, cross you. No, nobody can cross the limit set by you. I mean, it's the extreme limit. Sarup Gosai. So many things written there in Chaitanya Charitamitra. So, we all go here, going to follow the standard set by Mahaprabhu. I mean, by Sarup Gosai. Even, you know, anybody coming with any words, any poetry, any novel, any writing. Mahaprabhu, it was the usual rule that writings should be approved by Sarup, Sarup Gosai first. Otherwise, Mahaprabhu cannot read. Mahaprabhu cannot hear. It was the general rules said by Mahaprabhu. First of all, any writing, anybody going, you know, going to bring that writing should be approved first by Sarup Gosai. 
then onward, if Sarup Goswami is going to think it's all okay, there is no, there is no problem, problem mean, there is no defect, there is no wrong Siddhanta, there is no wrong Siddhanta, there is no Rasabhas, Rasabhas mean, cross connection of Rasa, cross connection of Rasa, like Yashodama watching Rasa Leela, impossible. Follow. Jashodama watching Rasalila of Krishna. How possible? It is called cross intersection of Rasa. Cross intersection. It's not good. Rasa, according to the candidate, because Yashodama is Basala Rasa. Basala Rasa. So, how possible that the Jashodama going to watch Rasalila? It's wrong Siddhanta. This way so many, countless Rasabha Siddhanta Virod going in a whole world. Who can detect? Who can detect? Is there any man who is enjoying the full Kripa, Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati? Only and only he can detect. No other man. Only and only who is going to get full Kripa, Prabhupada. Immediately he can arrest. What is wrong Siddhanta? A rasava is wrong Siddhanta. It's not possible. Maybe they are going to quote the name of Prabhupada. The Prabhupada told, but genuine devotee can understand it's not possible. Now our point is that if we are going to if we are going to follow a fallen soul as our standard, suppose. Suppose we are going to follow one fallen soul as our standard, then what kind of improvement you can expect in your life? Suppose you don't know, you are foolish, very simple hearted, you are very simple hearted, you are fully foolish, foolish in the sin. I am speaking with loveful attitude, not going to insult anybody. Suppose you are going to follow a fallen soul as your standard, then how you can expect your improvement in bhajan? You cannot expect improvement in your bhajan. So, this is the main point. At present, in this Kalikal, in this Kalikal, Maya Devi making different kind of, you know, plan and program Maya Devi making different kind of plan and program to divert us. Maya Devi making different kind of program, plan and program to divert us from the original track of bhakti. Maya Devi making different kind of plan and program to divert us from the track, original track. Now suppose our Guru Varga speaking, when Mahaprabhu was there, our Guru Varga speaking, when Mahaprabhu was there present, you can go through Chaitanya Bhagavad Chaitanya very carefully, very under the guidance of pure Guru Vishnu. You can see one vital point. Maybe there is thousands of devotees. Maybe there is thousands of devotees. They are following Gauranga Mahaprabhu, Nityananda Prabhu, Nityananda Prabhu means Gauranga Mahaprabhu, same thing. But one thing very important, they are following Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Maybe little different way, but there is no aparat. Thousands of devotees can be there, but their original motive is to satisfy Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Follow what is there. Maybe thousands of devotees. But all of them, some or other way, they are trying to satisfy Chaitanya Mahapu 100%. That is their goal. But your goal is different, his goal is different, her goal is different. If the goal, center point, if the center point is deviated little bit, 0 0.001 millimeter in geometry, geometry or no, geometry, mathematics. You point zero zero one millimeter deviation 
of the center can you divert can divert you from one one center one center point one center point with compass one center point with compass i can and with some and a radius little big bigger or lower i can adjust i can make countless circle but if you just you know the center point is displaced if the center point if the center point is displaced a little bit 0.00001 you can find the circle now you are going to draw in the paper can cut all previous circle can cut all previous circle because the center point goal is different that's why there is countless politics fighting different kind of fighting jealousy why because we are not doing hari bhajan if you do hari bhajan if i am doing hari bhajan if she is doing hari bhajan there we cannot expect any fighting how fighting can we can grow humble attitude well i cannot do hari bhajan what i have done i have done no seva in my life you have done more seva in brihad bhagavatam you know comparative statement this kind of mood can develop and when you are not when we are not doing hari bhajan then the question of fighting politics you know la puja pratishtha can come and contaminate our heart we can get deviated that is the our guru varga speaking perhaps our guru varga speaking perhaps you have seen this point if somebody not following chaitanya mahaprabhu if somebody going to get deviated little bit from chaitanya mahaprabhu little bit a little bit from chaitanya mahaprabhu immediately chaitanya mahaprabhu directly reject him like ballava charja i have written one commentary on bhagavad gita ah, what do you say i cannot obey sida saipa i reject ah, what do you say mahaprabhu reject him adwaita go say reject him everybody who not everybody reject him because chaitanya mahaprabhu reject him. you can see ka you can see kala krishna das you can see kala krishna das kala krishna das was rejected by mahaprabhu when come back when chaitanya when mahaprabhu come back when mahaprabhu came back from south indian trip immediately mahaprabhu speaking this is this is your kala krishna das you take it reject kala krishna das kala krishna das was rejected by mahaprabhu you can remember go through chaitanya charitamrita also you can see choto haridas small haridas as dama slight slight defect slight choto haridas immediately he was rejected by mahaprabhu rejected by mahaprabhu this way our prabhupad when following the total siddhanta vichara of gorang mahapu i mean what i mean to say if you like to get the exact teachings of chaitanya mahapu if you like to get the exact teaching of chaitanya mahapu what is intact what was there at the time of chaitanya mahapu you will have to follow bhakti siddhanta saraswati goswami jagat prabhupad you will have to follow bhakti vinod thakur kesav goswami maharaj sridhar maharaj bhakti vinod thakur goswami maharaj they are totally you will have to follow now popa speaking but the jeep bonded soul can never get keep up from directly i have money power i can arrange keep up i don't need any help acha up to the last moment of your life even after living this life you will have to depend upon guru parampara if you violate guru parampara then you are totally rejected many time i told the symptom of a pure devotee the symptom of a pure devotee is that 
the symptom of a pure devotee is there. He has strong belief in Gurudev and Guru Parampara. If not, if not, whole world can give both. He can preach all over the world, but Popat cannot approve. There is a main symptom with one devotee. So, actually, if we have material conception, because most of the, most of the people, most of the people, if not more, 99.99 percent or more than that, if not more, they are busy with material enjoyment, more or less. Somebody with honest heart can confess, well, Maharaj, I have some material concept, what to do? Maybe, fair, fair heart, going to confess, Maharaj, I have some, what to do? Okay, it's okay, still okay. But most of the people are not going to confess. That is the main problem. Most of the people are not going to confess, I have no materialism, I am a great Acharya, I am preaching, oh, you can follow me. Then why you cannot show me one sample? Then why you cannot show one sample that one of your disciples already getting, getting Tattvagyan? Like Haridas Thakur going to give Kripa to Lakshahira the cross, number one. She changed heart. She was converted into, into not gold. She was not converted into gold. She was converted into a touchstone. I mean, now she can touch you, touch me. Mani, we can all change your heart. Follow. There is the main thing. So most of the people, they have material conception. They have so many fighting inside them. They have so many doubts. So many doubts they have in their heart. And if they are at all going to put question in front of Gurudev and Vaishnav, if they cannot satisfy you, you have some question, doubt. It is the main symptom of a pure Vaishnav that if you have any doubt in your life, Guru Vaishnav can immediately cut that doubt. Erase any marking, any smell of doubt, pure Guru Vaishnav can erase from your heart. That is a symptom of pure Guru Vishnu. They cannot cheat you. So many people fighting. So many people fighting with so many facts. Even with Prabhupada, even with Bhakti Mirat Thakur. So many fighting going on. Many times I told before. Somebody speaking, big Acharya. Nobody protesting. All Gauriya Vaishnava Samaj, bless me, I started writing. And that Acharya gone from this world. He was going to establish wrong Siddhanta. But nobody is speaking. For the past 30 years, or 25 years, 30 years, wrong Siddhanta is there. Everybody reading that book. Where I can go? I have no power to go to America, France, Italy, Germany, no? I can speak in front of some limited devotee. I can do this much. Somebody speaking, it is not possible. Nithyananda Babu is sannyasi. How Nithyananda Babu can, can marry? Speaking, first of all I can clarify this point. Then I can explain. Otherwise you have some material idea and go to home. Well, Nithyananda Babu doing, I can also do it. I am sannyasi, I can throw. So I must clarify this point. Very Saradindu Rai, one big honorable personality doing bhajan at that time. He is asking, he is speaking to Prabhupada. Discussion going on. Saradindu Rai is speaking. Maharshi Saradindu Rai speaking. Prabhupada, within which within this short time, you are making fifty temples, Gauriam at all over world, everywhere. Pope was speaking, I wanted to get a living Gauriamat. 
I wanted to get a living Gauri. But what Prabhupada wanted to mean by living Gauri Amat mean? Living Gauri Amat mean? Was a mobile Gauri Amat. I mean, one, one Gauri Sadhu. Be careful. Nobody can make fool of you if you hear. I know most of the people going to avoid my, leg, my Harikatha. I know. But still with full enthusiastic mood, I am speaking with full enthusiastic mood that I am, my Harikatha is not, is not a means, a procedure to get love, puja and position. My Harikatha is the topmost service of Prabhupada. My Harikatha is the topmost servitorship of our Guru Bhargava. It is not one kind of means through which I can get your money, position, everything, not there. So I don't care you here or not here, you, you can go away. I don't care. So this way, Sarudindura is asking, Popat, you are preaching so much. Who is going to follow you? How many people are going to follow you? How many people are going to follow you? Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur. To him, as a gigantic personality, is the eternal person of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Eternal associate of Radharani, Nayanmani Manjari. In front of him, Saradindura is speaking. Popat, how many people are going to follow you in the whole world? Popat speaking, we cannot expect. We cannot expect that bonded soul, those who are busy, busy with material enjoyment, even those who are in sannyas, base is, Bhakti Muttaka speaking, your base is less important, not so important. Your base, your white base, Paramahansa base, or sannyasi base, or Brahmachari base, is less important. If you are doing more and more bhajan than me, your importancy is there. Follow what I say. If you are doing more and more bhajan than me, then your importance is more than me. Okay, external besa has some value. I am not speaking. But Bhakti Nautaku speaking specifically, external base is not the only thing. At present, anybody can take white base, red base, you know, sannas base, anybody. Anybody can take what it concerns to us. We are going to detect we are going to detect the whole, you know, you know, subject matter in the background of the touchstone, I mean, said by, you know, given by Sarup Gosai. Sarup Gosai giving us one stone. If we rub you, is, you know, 22 karat gold, you can understand. Follow. This way we can. Sarup Gosai giving us one stone, stone of Siddhanta Bichar, etiquette, by the help of which immediately we can arrest you. Immediately we can arrest you, we can understand, oh, it's false. But at present, at present, in course of time, in course of time course, in course of time, I mean Mahakal, you know Mahakal, that day I was speaking now, Mahakal, Putting one leg, footstep, this, this, this. What do you call time? What do you call time? We say Mahakal. Just yesterday you took birth. Now you are aged. Just yesterday I can remember I was playing with small boys, very football. This. Now I am going to leave my body. This is our scientific history of our life. What is, what is the mathematical interpretation of our life? What is the mathematical interpretation of our life? We are going to live for some year, some month, some fortnight, some week, some days, some hour, some second, some fraction of second. This is our life. Suppose one man took birth in the year of 1960. Follow. Now going to leave body? No. You can calculate. How many years? That year, 
How many years he is going to live? Maybe 64 years. And that year, you can convert that year, I mean, 64 years into second. 64 years multiplied by 12 months, multiplied by. Eh? This way you can do. I can convert. I can see one year mean how many second. So this is our mathematical interpretation of life. Those who are sincere devotee, they are always alert. Those who are sincere devotee, they are always alert like fire. If you look at any pure Vaishnava, you can see like fire glowing. If you look at him like fire, that's mean they are always alert. Alert about what? Alert about what? So that I cannot miss even fraction of second without Hari Bhajan. Alert about what? Alertness about what? I can be very careful even one fraction of second cannot go in my life without Hari Bhajan. Even fraction of second cannot go in vain without Hari Bhajan. Now they are going to compare their case. Suppose one sannyasi going to fall down, going to marry. Oh, Nichanguta. Idiot number one. In infinity period, they cannot get excuse. They cannot get kripa. Infinity period. They were. Those who are going to pass this kind of remark. First point is that Nityananda Prabhu is Baladev. Nityananda Prabhu is Baladev. Nityananda Prabhu is Baladev. At the same time, what do you mean by sannyas? What is the actual meaning of sannyas? What is the actual meaning of sannyas? Actual meaning of sannyas means you are going to dedicate hundred percent unto the lotus feet of Krishna for his satisfaction, hundred percent satisfaction. That is called sanyas. So Vishnu Piyadevi is top topmost sanyas. Janova Thakurani is topmost sanyas. Hemlata Thakurani, topmost sanyas. Ganga Mata, you know, Ganga Mata is, is the sister of Nityananda. Topmost sanyas. So what do you mean by sanyas? That day in Jum, that, that day in Jum Harikatha I was speaking. That day in Jum Harikatha I was speaking. That is actually Sanyas Mantra, including this also from Bhagavatam. It is from Bhagavatam. You can also open and see. Etam Sha Asthayo Paratmanishtha Madhyasitam Purvatanir Mahadbhir Aham Tarishwami Durantaparam Tamaha Mukundangri Nishevayu. What do you mean? It is a secret mantra of sannyas. Without realizing this mantra, nobody can take sannyas. Nobody can take. There is thousands of documents in Sastra I can show you. If you have enjoying mood, if you if you are not going to if you are not going to grow sufficient detachment for material enjoyment, who told you to take sannyas? Who told you, idiot? Why you take sannyas? To make problem all over the world? Who told you? It is written. If you can grow tremendous attraction, the symptom, I am speaking about disease and the symptom of disease. All I am speaking, you should remember. The main symptom I can detect in you. If I find you are hundred percent, you desire to hear Harikatha. Without hearing Harikatha, you can, Maharaj, speak Harikatha. Without Harikatha, you cannot live it, you cannot live your life. Without Harikatha, you cannot lead lead your life. You cannot live. That is a symptom. Bhagavad speaking. That is a symptom. I am hearing Harikatha all the time. How you are hearing? Echo, like echo coming from up. All Harikatha going on. Harikatha going on inside my that's why I am speaking to you. If Harikatha not going on, I am going to memorize last night, memorize Harikatha and speaking it. 
then I am idiot number one. Very shortly you can arrest me. You are kapat. If I have no connection with my Guru Bhargava, then false Harikatha. It is not Harikatha. It cannot touch your heart. So Harikatha going on inside the heart of Guru Bhargava all the time. Maybe they are sleeping. Harikatha Harikirtan. Harikatha Harikirtan continuously going on in their life. So Nityananda Prabhu is Baladev. Nityananda Prabhu is Baladev. Nityananda Prabhu in his life, what is doing, what not doing, everything depends upon Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Dedicated life, our dedicated life, our dedicated life, if not controlled by Guru Bhargava and Bhagavan, then your dedicated life is not actual dedicated life. If your dedicated life is totally controlled by Guru Bhargava, any seva you are doing, you can feel Guru Bhargava there, watching me. I cannot do any wrong. Always watching me. So, Nityananda Prabhu, I told, is the first expansion of Bhagavan. Nityananda Prabhu is the first expansion of Gauranga. Or I would say that Baladev is the first expansion of Krishna. First expansion, Baladev Prabhu can reserve the right of, you know, Baladev Prabhu can reserve the right of enjoyment. Follow. Baladev Prabhu can reserve the right of enjoyment because he is at the same time, simultaneously, he is Asraya Vigraha, at the same time, he is Sheb, you know, Vishay Vigraha. Both true. Only for, only for Balaram and only for Nityananda, both true. Simultaneously. Nityananda Prabhu is just non different from Gauranga, first expansion, and simultaneously we can say, Nityananda Prabhu, I mean Balaram, is you know asray vigraha at the same time vishay vigraha but still i am going to publish one article very shortly there you can find so many articles we are publishing so many with no time there bindavan dashtaku writing though there is mixed bhava though there is i am going to write maybe tomorrow can compose Though there is mixed bhava in Balaram, though there is mixed bhava in Balaram, mixed bhava, what do you mean? Mixed bhava means dasho bhava, because it is a das. At the same time, shakko bhava, yes or not? Because Balaram playing with Krishna, yes or not? So dasho bhava, shakko bhava there. Many times I over, you know, internet I told that day that in Vyad Bhagavad Gita that Baladev being the elder son, Jashodama or Rohini Masem actually, so is the elder brother of Krishna. So Jashodama giving responsibility of Krishna to Balaram. Baladev is big chanchal. Krishna, your brother is big chanchal, be careful. You can take care and the forest is going, going here and there. Any problem happens, you must control. Okay. Follow what I say? So that means, you are going to agree with me that Baldav, Nityananda, is Dashyabhav is there, Dashyabhav is there, eh? Shakobhav is there, at the same time being the elder brother, also, Vatsala Bhav is there. Three different kind of Baba, you know, there at a, at a time. But still, but still, you should not forget one time, one point. Though I am speaking, Siddhanta Vichad this way, you should not for, forget this point, what Bindamanda Staku writing. May, maybe there is some mixed Baba. Mixed Baba in the sense? Sometime Basala, sometime Sakya, sometime you know, Dasya, still. Bindavan Dasya Guru Mahasar writing, still. 
The Ashya Baba is the predominating factor. Those who are blind, those who are blind, those who are blind for them, I like to show them. You see, those who are blind, they cannot see, writing wrong way. For them, I would like to say that you go through Chaitanya Bhagavat, Bindaban Dasya Guru Mahasaya speaking. We know. But Bindaban Dasya Guru Mahasaya speaking, that Dasya Baba, Dasya Baba is the most predominating factor. Though other Baba there, but men, Dasya. Without Dasya, don't like to hear anything. Even if Basala, I can prove like mathematics. If Basala there, still, you know, there is Dasya. If Shakya, still I can prove there is Dasya. Dasya is a, someday I can discuss, because main discussion I cannot do. So, why Nityananda Prabhu going to marry? My first answer is that they should not compare the activities of Balaram Nityananda with their own activities. Why Baladev Nityananda going to break the sannyas danda of Gaurangma? Why Nityananda Prabhu going to break the danda of Mahaprabhu and throw into water? Why? Because Nityananda Prabhu talking with the danda. Hey, foolish danda! Eh? I am going to, I am going to bear my Prabhu inside my heart. Nityananda Prabhu with danda. Mahaprabhu going to take bath. With the danda, like mad. Like mad, Nityananda Prabhu talking with danda. Are you foolish? Eh? I am going to carry, I am going to keep my Prabhu in my heart. And that Prabhu, how much adversity you have, that Prabhu going to carry you? I cannot tolerate. I'm going to break into three pieces and throw. I mean, Mahaprabhu is kapat sannyas. I mean, Mahaprabhu is kapat sannyas. We can arrest Mahaprabhu. It's kapat sannyas. And Nityananda Prabhu, not purposely taking sannyas. Big discussion. I don't like to do it now. Nityananda Prabhu, it is, the it is the arrangement of Bhagavan. It is the arrangement of Bhagavan. Nityananda is Abhadut Sanyasi. Nityananda Prabhu is Abhadut Sanyasi. Abhadut Mane? Abhadut Mane, whatever you can do, it is out of your, out of your discussion. You have no right. Or you cannot conceive. Nityananda Prabhu Sanya, in about Paramahansa, about those who are abadut, about those who are abadut, it is written in Bhagavatam. Bhagavan Sri Krishna was speaking to Uddhav. Bhagavan Sri Krishna was speaking to Uddhav. Jnana nishtho virakto va madbhakto va anapakshakaha sa linganam asramam stakta charet abhidi gochara. Charet abhidi, abhidi gochara. They are beyond any rules and regulations. They are beyond any rule. You cannot confine them within some, cert, some and certain rules and say, okay, you will have to obey them. No! They are beyond any rules and regulation. You are going to, you know. So, this, this example you should remember. Bhagavan Sikh is now speaking to Uddhav. Jnana nishtho virakto va madbhakto va anapekshakaha Shalinganam asramam stakta chared abhidi gochara. They are beyond any rules and regulations. Those are, you, externally you can find they are crazy. Externally you can find they are crazy, just crazy, but they are not crazy. In absorbing Baba, they are, they are in absorbing Krishna Prema. So sometimes laughing, ha ha ha, sometimes crying, sometimes rolling down and crying. Eh? What are doing? Why? When, what doing, who knows? So, Gyananishtha Viraktoba, Madhbhaktoba Anapekshakaha, Shalinganam Asramam Stakta Chared Abhidigocha. They can, they can avoid, they can avoid this base, they can avoid Danda, even they can throw Kamandul, you know, water pot, a sannyasi crying, they can throw. They can throw. Because they are Abhudut. Bhagavan is there inside their heart. Always there. What use of sannyas? 
Mahaprabhu speaking after taking sannyas. We know we are like detective department. We are going to arrest Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu speaking what? After taking sannyas, Mahaprabhu someday speaking, running towards Vrindavan. It is written in Chaitanya Chaitanya. What use of taking sannyas? Mahaprabhu speaking. Mahaprabhu taking sannyas. After the running towards Vrindavan, and like crazy. What use of taking sannyas? Prem, love, prema is my own property. What use of taking sannyas? What Mahaprabhu want to say? You know, I mean, Mahaprabhu is going to declare the secret point. The main, main thing of taking sannyas is to grow tremendous love, unabated, unlimited love for Bhagavan. Dedication, serving mood. So you understand the main meaning? Mahaprabhu speaking. What use of taking sannyas? Prem is, prema is my own property. Eh? Unnecessary. That means Mahaprabhu won't declare this fine. So Nityananda Prabhu took sannyas. How? Long history. Somebody speaking, Nityananda Prabhu had no Dandakamandul, but I can prove. Dandakamandul was there. Dandakamandul was there when Nityananda Prabhu came from Vrindavan to meet with Gauranga. When by that time Gauranga Mahaprabhu manifested himself. For Sankitan Jagwa and Sankitan Ras. Nityananda Prabhu coming. First staying in the house of Nandana Chajyo, second from there, first meeting at Nandana Chajyo Bhavan. First meeting with Gorang Mahapu in Nandana Chajyo Bhavan. Then onward, Mahapu used, Nityanand Babu used to stay in the house of Shivas Pandit. One day in the morning time, Siram Pandit, one day, in the morning, because Nithyanambu is staying there in their house. In the morning time, the brother of Sarup, uh, the brother of the brother of Sivas Pandit, Shiram Pandit, the brother of Sivas Pandit, in the morning time, come out in the veranda and watch all the danda, I mean the danda and the common water pot all broken into pieces. Who break? He is going to call brother. Oh, brother, you come there, you see. The Donda and Kamundu are all broken into pieces there. Goranga Mapu came onward. The message went to Goranga Mapu. Follow. All activities I am going to speak. How nice, related thing. Sivas Pandit immediately informed Goranga Mapu. Goranga Mapu ran and coming. And collecting all danda and kamandul and going all with all devotees to take bath in Ganga. Follow what I say. What I mean to say, try to understand, realize. Gorang Mahapu not going to not going to shout. Why you break your danda kamandal? Not speaking. Mahapu coming there and collecting all broken danda and kamandul and going to take bath in Ganga with Nithananda. I mean, it is the approval of, I mean. It is surely the approval of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. I mean, it is the any pure devotee, any pure devotee, whatever they are doing, any pure devotee, whatever they are doing, they are doing, they are doing each and every action they, of their action is and by the desire of Gauranga, by the desire of Krishna. A pure devotee always doing anything. By the desire of Bhagavan. So if Nithyananda is going to break down and come and rule, it is the approval of Goranga. That's why otherwise why Goranga collecting and throw? Because no use. The reason for why you took enough of it, this kind of Leela. Now you will have to manifest the path. Then after that, Sankirtan going on. Main point is that Baladev used to wear blue cloth, you know, blue. Blue cloth. Deep blue cloth. Blue cloth. Blue cloth is a symptom of infinity. If you look at the sky in the in a, uh, uh, you know you know in autumn, you know, if you look at sky, deep blue, you know, sky, deep blue, it is the arrangement of Bhagavan. Sunlight, you know, sunlight coming in the way of sunlight coming, the rays of sunlight, 
get refracted by all dust particles there and ultimately going to absorb all other color and going to throw, emit only blue color. This is scientific explanation, physics. Those who read physics, higher mathematics, physics, they can understand. So, Nityananda Prabhu wearing blue cloth and Balaji Maharaj also used to blue cloth. Krishna using golden cloth. Yes, na? Krishna using golden cloth, na? No? What is the symptom? Why Krishna using golden cloth? Golden cloth is the symptom of Radharani. Krishna is going to give honor to Radharani. That's why wearing golden cloth, golden complexion of Radharani. And Baldev Ji Maharaj using really so, he is Anantadev. Baldev Nityananda is Anantadev. So what is using this blue cloth? Nobody can wear. No sadhu, no sannyasi, no brahmachari. Those who, are, those who are sadhu, they cannot wear blue cloth. Blue cloth, we can give honor to Nityananda. Nobody can wear. Oh, Matajis they can use. That is different. So this way, when all Gauriya devotees is going there in Purushottam Dham, according to desire of, because at the time of Chaturmasa, at the, te, at the time of Chaturmasa, usually all Gauriya devotees, they used to go there to meet with their heart, to meet, to meet with their heart, Gauranga. Every year, they used to go. Hello, they used to go. One year, one year, who knows why, one year, while all devotees going away, Mahaprabhu crying and giving, you know, see off. All devotees, Prabhu, we are coming. Huh? Prabhu crying, cannot give answer. Because devotees, they are the heart of Mahaprabhu. Our Guru Pātpada wrote one book, na? Heart of Krishna. Devotees are the heart of Krishna. And, those, and uh, Krishna is the heart of all devotees. Aham bhakta paradhino hi asatantra ivodiyo. This way, who knows why? Nobody knows the secrecy. While going to Bangla, I mean everybody, after Chaturmasa is over, everybody going on, Mahaprabhu called Nityananda secretly in the room. Mahaprabhu called Nityananda secretly in the, in, in the room, and going to speak something, who knows what? Nobody knows. What discussion going on, Nithyananda Gauranga was speaking to Nithyananda, who knows? When Nithyananda was coming back here, they are going to manifest one ec excellent Leela. Excellent what Leela? Excellent. <coughs> Gauranga was speaking, you should preach Krishna Nam, Krishna Katha, door to door, everywhere, all bonded soul, they should get facility, even Muslim people. <coughs> we have not disparity. Even Muslim people, they are allowed to hear Krishna Katha. I can speak if they like to hear. <coughs> I cannot avoid them. <coughs> After that, Gauranga Mahapur started preaching. One day, I like to speak so much, a vast chapter, but time is very limited. Suryoda <coughs> Sarkhel. Suryoda Sarkhel. Suryoda Pandit and Gauridas Pandit. You know the no, name of Gauridas Pandit? Suryoda Pandit. Gauridas Pandit, Krishna Das, all five brothers there. I am speaking two or three or four, two, three. Gauridas Pandit in Kalna, you know, Kalna. There Gauridas Pandit Sipad, many times I told before you can remember. In the form of deity, Gaur Nityananda, there. 
brother of Gauridas Pandit is Shujadas Pandit. One day, Shujadas Pandit, one day Shujadas Pandit thinking about, one day Shujadas Pandit thinking about how to arrange marriage, how to arrange marriage of two of my daughters. How to arrange marriage? It's a beautiful lady, beautiful daughter, like Devakanya, you know, as if they are actually Devakanya, money from heaven they are coming. Heaven is, <laughs> example, I'm, it is joking. They are coming from Golok. <laughs> I'm just, you know, with joking mood. Where I can get this kind of matching, you know, husband? Thinking. And taking rest in the night time. Taking rest in the night time. Then in the, in the dream. In the dream. Somebody giving instruction. Your two daughter is the eternal Shakti of Nithyananda Balaram. Why you are thinking? In dream. You break dream? What? Nithyananda? Nithyananda Balaram? Because Reboti and Baroni, two wife, two Shakti of Balaram. Two Shakti of Balaram, two Shakti of Balaram, na? Reboti and Baroni. Reboti and Baroni. Two, you know. They are coming in the form of, you know, Janava Devi and Vasudha Mata. In Bhagavata, you can find a discussion. You know, they are the son of one big king, Revat Raja, Revat. Which is like fire in Shatta Yuga. In Bhagavatam, it is there. You go through Bhagavatam discourse, you can find someday. Revat Raja is in Shatta Yuga, as a big king controlling the whole world. He is so powerful, like Sun God. One day, Revat Raja thinking what to do, uh, how to arrange the marriage of my, you know, Revati. Then going to Brahma, to ask, I am not going to return. Then after that, Brahma giving instruction, eternal husband, she, <coughs> she is the eternal <coughs> Shakti of Baladev. Baladev? Yes. You go now, now you come to me, Satyajuk. Now while you are staying here in, you know, to ask me question, within this time interval, or Satyajuk gone, uh, Shatra Yuga gone, Teta Yuga gone, now Dapar already end. Ah, huh? whatever, Relate, related time now. That day you can realize, at least like sign, li like, at least you can realize, if you can realize like Einstein, at least. Because realization of time is big, Einstein could realize. Sometimes what is time is to go mad. But if I speak what is time, you can know casually. Time is time, I can see what is time. But Einstein used to get a heavy realization about time. Follow. But still, a Prakita realization was not there. He was a scientist. But if you can realize someday what is time, time in Mahakal, then you can go mad. Infinity period. Time is flowing like the water of Ganga. Time is going in your life. When you took birth before in your life, still before, still before, this way time going. You are taking different kind of form, sometime taking birth in German, take, sometime taking birth in America. But Jivatma, all flowing. In course of traveling, by chance, who knows, you are coming here in Navadip Dam and getting the dust particle from Navadip. How lucky. If you can estimate your luck, you cannot cry. You cannot cry. If you can estimate your luck, how much lucky you are. You can see the population of the world, how much population. And we, a, among, you know, out of that great big population all over the world, one, two, three, four. 
they are doing actual Hari Bhajan. If you can realize, you can go mad. So, Revati you know, and Barani, they are the eternal Sakti of Balaji Maharaj. And Janama Vasudha Mata, eternal Sakti of Nityananda. Why Nityananda going to marry? You have no right to speak that way. You forget he is Bhagavan. You forget. Now you can put question. I like to give answer to so many questions. But if somebody can put question, Maharaj, you already told. The idealism said by Bhagavan, idealism said by Guru Vaishnava, we should follow. You can, you can put question to me. You are foolish, that's why you are not putting question in front of me. <laughs> if you are not foolish, immediately you should you know, put question. Why not? You told already. Is idealism. Now you are speaking just opposite. I am not speaking opposite. I am not speaking opposite. It is written there in Bhagavatam. It is written there in Bhagavatam. Those who are big, big personality, godly, you know, like Sankar Bhagavan, like Krishna, Balaram, you cannot imitate them. It is written in Bhagavatam. I can show you someday. If time permit, I can go through the, the, only this discussion. It is written, imitation, if I imitate my Guru Maharaj, imitation is prohibited. Follow. I can follow my Guru Maharaj. To follow Guru Maharaj and to imitate Guru Maharaj, not the same. So when big, big personality, those who are going, going to speak this way, you have no right to imitate. You will have to follow only their instruction. Like one example I can speak. Like one example. I can, I can speak to you. Bhaktivinoda Thakur doing Harinam and those Sahajiyas, they are doing Kirtan. Ah, oh, so nice Kirtan. Everybody dancing. And Bhaktivinoda Thakur doing Hare Krishna. Why? We cannot follow Bhaktivinoda Thakur. We can all, also arrange Sahajiya. They can do. Why Bhaktivinoda Thakur doing? We have seen, we have seen, we have documents that Prabhupada in Dhaka, in Dhaka, you know, that time India. In Dhaka, Julanbari, Julanbari, one place, they are Prabhupada continuously doing Harinam. Doing Harinam and explaining, explaining, explaining Bhagavatam Janma Dasya Yato Slok, one slok. One month. For one month, Prabhupada speaking, Janma Dasya Yato, this slok explains. You can do? You can do? You can imitate Prabhupada? Prabhupada doing Harinam and explaining. Is it possible for you? Guru Maharaj speaking. Directly Guru Maharaj told me. That Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada, he is going here and there, in lawn, in lawn, you know, in the morning time walking, in the lawn. In Chaitanya Mahat lawn. Lawn, you know, grass is there, barefooted, Prabhupada going here and there. And four writers, my Guru Maharaj, Bhakti Pumaturi Goswami Maharaj, Pranamananda Brahmacharya yeah, is one. Another writer, you know, Sundarando. Another writer, that time he was, you know, Ananta Basudev. Another four writer. And same man going to go here and there. Pranamananda, how much you write about the article of Gauriya? How far you write? Popad, I write, okay, now you go on writing. Guru Maharaj writing, in the meantime, Prabhupada saying, that book, how, how far you write that book? That part, Prabhupada dictating. You see, how possible, miracle. Guru Padmati, even demigods they cannot do. Even demigods in the heaven, they cannot do. At the same time, doing Harinam. Prabhupada doing Harinam. At the same time, giving the dictation, going to, going to give the dictation of Gauriya Patrika, going to give the dictation of Sajjanta Sani, going to dictation of some book, some article, at a time. Gave dictation, without watching anything. Doing very now. How possible? You can do? If I speak one Siddhanta Vijayamada, what you told yesterday, I can forget. 
<laughs> you can think. This way, you can see. I cannot remember, you can. This way. Because we are detached from bhajan. The day you can do bhajan uninterrupted way, the day you can go this kind of mood, you can also remember it. You can also speak Harikatha in front of thousands of people. Because memory coming from inside, not from this small brain. <laughs> heart is their memory. Yeah, their heart is their memory. So this way, that Surjodas Pandit running uh, towards one, uh, one, one friend, Brahman friend. Oh, my friend, yesterday in dream, this kind of thing happened. Oh, really? Then what to do? A Brahman speaking, why not? It is the indication. So, so why not you can go? Where is Nithyananda Prabhu? At present, there is Siva Sangam in Mayapur, Navadip. You can go? Yes, I can go. With this proposal. That Brahman speaking, the friend of Suryodas Pand Pandit. Well, I can go. Well, I can go with this proposal. Is going there. Going to speak this proposal to Sivas Pandit. Sivas Pandit is very happy. Going to give this proposal to Nithyananda Prabhu. You can give a best to Kepa on Suryodas Pandit. All arrangement by Gauranga Mahapu. All arrangement by <laughs> Even kind of drama, Nithyananda was laughing. Yes, yes, I approve. Nithyananda approve. I mean, I can bestow kipa on Suryodas Pandit. The name of Suryodas Pandit is Suryodas Sarkel. Sarkel. Sarkel means the accountant. You know? Sarkel, this title, Sarkel, this title on those days. Sharkhel, this title, he got because he is the accountant of the king of Bengal. Those who are going to maintain the account, account expenditure, they are going to get this kind of title, you know, title. This is called Sharkhel. Sharkhel, this title. Like at present we say charter accountant, we speak now. Cost accountant, charter accountant, we speak now. Charter accountant. So now Suryodha Pandit, after hearing that Nithyananda Prabhu approved this proposal, I mean this arrangement, started dancing. This kind of big arrangement was there. So the arrangement of this marriage, I mean Nithyananda going to marry two daughters, the two daughters of Suryodha Pandit, one is one is, one is Vasudhama, another is Janabama. Vasudhama, she is the elder sister. Vasudhama, she is the elder sister. Elder sister of Janava Devi. Both of them got married. I am not going in details. That marriage place is also there in Kalna. So many things, documents there. And after that, Nityananda Babu started traveling in different places. Different places, I don't like to go in detail, so many. First coming to meet with Sachima. Sachima, she was very happy. She was so happy catching, catching Janava Basuda and kissing. My daughter, you are very lucky, Nityananda Babu married. After that, Nithyananda Babu going here and there, so many places. The house of Advaita Gosai, Advaita Gosai in Santipur. There also Sitama, Sitama, Sita Thakurani, Sita Thakurani. I mean the wife of Advaita Gosai, Shakti. Wife, we should not speak. Shakti of Advaita Gosai. Going to embrace and going to kiss. They are staying for some day. For some day, going to stay in Sachimata Bhavan. Going to stay for some day in Advaita Bhavan, sometime they are in Siva Sangan or different places. Based on Kripa on them. Finally, I like to say about Janava Thakurani. Janava Thakurani, I already in the starting I told. In the starting I told, we cannot get Kripa of Bhagavan directly. 
we can keep, we can get kripa from Bhagavan through tat shakti tat prakas. I already told now. Tat prakas mean, eh? Tat prakas mean prakas sab sab prakas vigro, and tat shakti mean you know our guru bhargu sigo ura karuna shakti vigro hai. We speak na. Namam Vishnu Padayo Gaura Pishtayo Bhutale Shimate Bhakti Siddhant Saraswati Dinamine. We speak in the Or you say Namo Bhakti Vinodayo Satchidananda Namine Gaura Shakti Sarupayo. We speak in So through Shakti and through, through Prakash, Prakash means Dham is also Prakash. This Dham, you know, this Dham where you are is also Prakash. Dham is also prakas of Saru Shakti. Dham. Oh, this way, all we are getting kipa. So through Shakti, through prakas. I already told, I someday I can discuss with this point. Those who are big, big like Bhagavan, those who are big, big Bhagavan, those who are avatar, we, sh we cannot imitate them. Shankar Bhagavan, is there Shankar Bhagavan going to drink all poison? Eh? Shankar Bhagavan going to drink poison? Hala hal bees. I mean, when Shankar Bhagavan drinking poison, only uh, percolate, you know, percolate? You know, no, no, percolate? When coming from drop by drop, percolate. This way, drinking. Then some poison dropping in ground. And that poison going to make so many snack. So many snack, tak a scorpio. How oh, wonder? Only some drop when drinking, fall down. That poison, now in front of us, we can get those poison in the form of snack, in the form of scorpio. Oh my god. So much poison. Yes, only drop. So if you like to say, if we like to say, we can imitate Sankar Bhagavan, not possible. One drop of poison, if I give to you, you can die. Because you are not Sankar. You are not Sankar. One drop of poison, you cannot take. You can die immediately. So you cannot imitate the behavior of Sankar Bhagavan. You can catch Ganga. You can catch Ganga on, on head. All, everybody failure. All demigods, all, everybody failure. Then Bhagirath, going to pray to Sankar Bhagavan. Ganga Mata, my Ganga coming down from heaven, who can protect? Not heaven actually, it's, a, it's coming from, you know, from transcendental world, Ganga coming. But if, in heaven also I have flow. Sarge in heaven, Bhagavati. The name of Ganga in heaven is Bhagavati. Eh? Here, Alokalanda. And down also another name. <laughs> Mandakini, eh? Alokananda, different name. So, when Bhagirath Maharaj requesting, please come. Then, ultimately, Shankar Bhagavan agree. And going to, in matted here, now matted here, and make some space. Make some space in matted here. Okay, Ganga can come. Ganga falling from up. And Shankar Bhagavan catching Ganga and in mat. Ganga rolling, 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 rolling in. Not coming out. Bhagavan took it. Oh, Baba, oh, my father, I am not giving Ganga for your preservation. You will have to uh, allow Ganga to come. Oh, really? Then make a space, then Ganga coming out. Hello. This way Ganga come. So, this way actually, Ganga coming, this way. So, what I wanted to say? What I wanted to say, main discussion. This way actually, Alakananda coming this way. So what Sankar Bhagavan can do, you cannot imitate. What Krishna can do, you cannot imitate. What Baladev Nityananda can do, you have no right to imitate. Because imitation, 
by imitation, you can destroy yourself. You cannot imitate. So, it is written in Bhagavatam, only you can follow the instruction of those big, big, you know, spiritual person. Like Prabhupada, Bhakti, you know, I cannot imitate. Even Sankar Bhagavan, even Baladev, Nityananda, Gaurodi, we cannot imitate them. What they are speaking, you do it. Tasam jo bacho yuktam buddhibam tam samacharet. In Bhagavatam it is written, those are really intelligent, they cannot imitate them. Only they can depend upon the instruction given by them. You cannot follow Krishna. I can do also ras with beautiful ladies. No, you cannot do. Only what Krishna is speaking in Gita, Bhagavatam, you have to follow. Because Bhagavan Sri Krishna, why doing what? You think everything in enjoying mood. You think Rasa Leela in enjoying mood. Though I discuss so many things about the introductory speech of Rasa Leela, so many things, still I am not satisfied. Still I know. Material people are always busy with material conception. They cannot understand why Krishna doing Ras. It is not enjoyment. It is not, Krishna is not busy to enjoy with some foolish people. Not that. It's so deep meaning. So, what Balaram doing? Rasa Leela Balaram. So, also you cannot imitate. What Pope are doing? We cannot imitate. What, what, what Pope are speaking? You will have to follow. What Bhakti is speaking? You will have to follow. You cannot imitate them. So, you cannot say that Janava Mata, Janava Mata is the topmost Acharya. What do you say? Yes. Janava Mata Thakurani is the topmost Acharya. We can also make Lady Acharya. Foolish. <laughs> Foolish people. Janamata can act as Acharya. Janamata can act as Acharya. Gangamata can act as Acharya. But ordinary lady, they cannot act as Acharya. Those who are totally beyond, they, those, who are, those who are totally beyond any limitation of this material world, phenomena, they can. Like Janavata Gurani. Janavata Gurani is equal to Nityananda. How you can say? Yes. Janavata Gurani and Nityananda are non different from each other. Why? From Vedanta Sutta. I already told in Vedanta Sutta. Shakti, Shakti, Matur, Abhet. Shakti, Shakti, Matur, Abhet. I told many times. Vedanta Sutta. Shakti Man. Shakti man and the Sakti, non-different from Radharani and Krishna, non-different from either. There is so many documents from Bhagavatam, I can show. Bhagavatam glorification, Skanda Puran, Sha Evo Sha. Sha Evo Sha. Who is Radharani? She is Krishna. Who is Krishna? He is Radharani. But you cannot understand. You cannot make any meaning of what I mean to say. So, Janava Thakurani is non-different from Nityananda. So, when Nityananda disappears from the material world, you cannot find any Samadhi of Nityananda. You can find? Because Nityananda disappeared in Banke, ba, uh, Banke Rai, in Ek Chakra. Janava Thakurani disappeared in Gopinath. Gorang Mapu disappear in Jagannath, somebody speaking in Gopinath, somebody speaking in sea, ocean. Advaita Gosai disappear in Madan Gopa. <laughs> you cannot make any, you can find the Samadhi Mandira? No, Sivas Pandit disappear. Logic cannot, you cannot, logic cannot stand. Logical interpretation cannot stand in the way of that absolute truth. That's why I like to put warning to you. So many things I like to speak about Janava Thakurani. It's a vast thing. At the same time, I like to speak about this, you know, Ram Shakti Shita Devi, where you can give time to me. Follow. Janava Thakurani, after Gorang, after that, you know, Nityananda would disappear. 
in short, in brief, I am speaking. Janna Thakurani, you know, manifesting Acharya. He is eternally Acharya. She is acting as Acharya. So many days. But that for that any lady I can make Acharya, not possible. Wrong Siddhanta. In Upanishad, we can find some lady, Maitri, Gargi, Kattayani, those lady. They are beyond any body limit. They are beyond any body limit. They cannot, you cannot say they are women. They are beyond any body limit. We can say they are Rishi, Lady Rishi. They are giving so many, you know, verses of Veda, this, that, so many ladies. I can show in Veda, in Upanishad, so many ladies there. They are beyond any body limits. They are beyond any body limits. They can take red cloth. They are actually sannyas. They are beyond any body limits. They can take red cloth. They can follow Brahmacharya, but ordinary women cannot do. Not possible. So, only those who are beyond any body limit, beyond any body limit in the sense, I like to see, I like to speak what? Those who are beyond any body limit, those who are transcendental figure, they can act as Acharya. Any woman I can select Acharya, you cannot do. It is not the question of voting. Voting right you have. That is your privilege. But by voting right, you cannot enjoy the keeper of Acharya. It's an automatic factor. It's an automatic factor. So, this way, Janavadha Gurani acting as Acharya. So many things I like to speak. But some vital point I can discuss. Like, Khetori Utsav, you know, evergreen. Khetori, one place at present in Bangladesh, Ras Sahi, Shantos Dattu was the king. Unparalleled, unbeaten, unmatched up to now in the history, in the history of world, in the history of this world, never in past this kind of festival was there. It's called Khetori festival. Or Sinivasa Chajyo, Ramchandra, Srinivasa Chajyo, Samananda Prabhu, Nartam Thakur, when Gauranga Mahapur disappear, when Nityananda Prabhu disappear, when Adhaita Gosai disappear, when Sivas Pandit disappear, when Gadadhar Pandit disappear, <coughs> when all that disappear. After that, it is the arrangement of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, Srinivasa Chajyo, coming from Gauranga Mahapur. Uh, Narthamon Thakur coming from Nityananda. Samananda Prabhu coming from <coughs> Adhita Gosai. They, you know, coming from... It is written in Shastra, they are non-different from Gauranga. They are making vast preaching. So... Big, big devotees. Oh, they are eternal person. They all started preaching. <coughs> so in <coughs> Rasai, their Ketori Utsav, Jannabar Thakurani, Jannabar Thakurani, she was the chairman. She was arranging all. Jannabar Thakurani, everybody, everybody with folded hand, coming, praying, Dandavat to Jannabar Thakurani. Even, um, <coughs> but Janavata Gurani, for our teaching, Janavata Gurani need not pay any dandavat to them. But when all, everybody paying dandavat to Janavata Gurani, Janavata Gurani also paying dandavat to them, for our teachings. Janavata Gurani arranging all festival. Janavata Gurani arrange all cooking for deities. Six deities at a time were installed by Srinivas Achajyo. A golden period, a golden period, I cannot speak out, golden period, six deities at a time installed. Chanuvata Gurani cooking for deities, arranging all, even after, you know, when the Adivas city, when 
Six deities were installed just in the appearance day of Gauranga Mahapur. I mean Gaur Purnim. Just previous day. I mean the Adhivas, I mean the Adhivas city of Gauranga, you know, Gaur Purnim. They are all started Kirtan. They started Kirtan. And they started Kirtan. Janavatakarini watching and shedding tears and Gaur Nityananda appeared in the Kirtan. You can imagine? You can imagine? They are doing Kirtan. Ramchandra Kaviraj, Srinivasa Jajjo, just you know, doing Kirtan. And Gaur Nityananda appeared there in Sankirtan, Jagya, dancing, Gaur. Everybody can watch. Those were lucky. Gaur Nityananda appeared. This way, big festival was arranged, evergreen. I think, no bhutam no bhavishwati. I think, in future nobody can do, in past nobody done. This kind of festival. After that, from there, I am very short discussion I am doing. Janavatagarani with some devotees running towards Vindavan. In Vrindavan, taking so dust and everything, I'm, I'm just, I'm cutting short. Different darshan and Vrindavan everywhere. Everywhere. After some darshan, all Goswamis, Jiva Goswamipad, Jiva Goswamipad, Gopal, what all coming to pay Dandavat. Janvata Gurinu also paying Dandavat to them. Madhu Pandit. Also disappearance, how I can discuss. But I can say this much, Madhu Pandit is a disciple of Janavathakurani. She was a Niskinchan Sadhu. He was a Niskinchan Sadhu. He used to live in Bangshibat. Bangshibat, you know? The Rasasthali, the place where Krishna there. One day, Madhu Pandit watching so many Leela. I like to touch only. Absorbing Leela is watching. Krishna, Balaram, all Sakha playing. What is this? Directly watching. After that, go faint. Krishna, Balaram taking less in Bhangshibat. They are all sitting, all covered boys, and playing Leela. And Madhu Pandit, go faint. After that, when open eyes, all vanish, nothing. Only fine. One deity, Gopinath. Only find one deity in front of him. Are you? In Bhangshivad, in Bhangshivad, Gopinath appeared in front of Madhu Pandit. This much I can say, I have no time. From then onward, he started doing Seva of Gopinath. He's a very great devotee. I used to stay there in Gopinath Gera. Many times I was doing Nam Jagya, these are so many. All de 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 devotees they know. Sometime here, sometime in Vindavan, different place. Nam Jogya, this. That is a place. Madhu Pandit Samadhi here? Here. Great. Now, about Janavata Karani, I can say this much. I have no time. Janavata Karani from Vindavan coming here again, making, you know, you know doing preaching, extensive preaching. And the daughter of Nityananda Prabhu is Ganga Mata. And the son of Nityananda Prabhu is Birbhadra, Birchandra or Birbhadra. But Janumata Gurani, she has no children. She is active Acharya. All the time doing, you know, this way, Janumata Gurani, you know, we are successful. We are very happy. Our, our, our Bhaktivinoda Thakur crying and speaking. Bhavar nave pari mon akulo paran kabe kul pavo kabe kul pavo. This way. After that, Bhaktivinoda writing in kids and I can go to Janava Thakurani. Crying, Bhaktivinoda crying and speaking. To Janava Thakurani. Toma charan tori koriya asroy, bhavar nava par hava korichin is By taking shelter 
of your lotus feet, we have taken resolution to cross over this material world. Who writing? Bhaktimutta writing. Ho Janama Mata, Ho Nityananda Sakti, Ho Janama Thakurani. Please, 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 best to keep up. By taking shelter of your lotus feet, it is like boat, ship. We can take shelter of your lotus feet and cross over this infinite material world. Creation. Toma charantari kuriya asroy, babar nava par havo korechin is choy. We have taken resolution that by taking shelter of your lotus feet, he Nityananda Sakti. Another name of Nityananda Sakti Janavata Kurani is Ananga Manjuri. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Nityananda Babu is there inside Rasa Lila. Nityananda Babu taking and deck and you know you know Nitananda Babu is there already in Rasa Lila, but not directly. In the form of in the form of Janabathakuran. Eh, eh, eh? Eh? Ananga Manjuri. Janabathakurani means Ananga Manjuri. Still today, when I was there in Bindavan, Govardhan, sometime go cool in Surya Kundo, Govardhan. So, always I like to, I wanted to, whenever doing Parikram of Govardhan, Janavatakurani Parikram, sit there for some time and pray. Because Janavatakurani, there is there, Janavatakurani used to, there that time. January used to stay under a tree, that tree is also there. From there you can paste Dandavat to Radha Kund, Sam Kund, everything Janavata Gurani here. Follow Janavata Gurani. You can pay Dandavat to Janavata Gurani directly. Because Janavata Gurani is Guru. Janavata Gurani is Guru, na? Okay, you can do. Anyway, this way Janavata Gurani is the Ananga Manjuri. She is already there in Rasa Leela, taking, taking part in Rasa Leela also. This way, Janu. Now, I wanted to speak so many things, but I am foolish. I couldn't speak anything. I like to touch also Sita Thakurani. Sita Thakurani, she is the Sakti of Ramchandra. If I don't touch, I can get punishment, so I can... Maybe it will take time. So, Sita Thakurani, she is the eternal Shakti of Ramchandra. I mean, Ramchandra is non-different from Sita Devi. Sita Devi is also going to express excellent idealism. Sita Devi took birth in Janakpuri. Sita Devi took birth in Janakpuri, in Mithila, you know, in Bihar, north part, north part, North, north part of Bihar state is Janakpuri. It is the border of Nepal. If Nepal, you know, Raksal. I've been there long ago, but, I, you know, Raksal, I went from Raksal very near. Follow. There. There is Sita Raghurani. I mean, you know, the daughter of Janakraj. She took birth. Anyway, there is so much, you know, uh, in different Puran, different kind of, somebody speaking, you know, this way, that way. Anyway, so Sita Thakurani is the eternal Shakti of Ramchandra. So naturally, Ramchandra, you know, going to marry Sita Devi. Marry also, excellent marriage. Swayangbar Sabana, I mean, on those days, the daughter can select own husband. Sita Thakurani going to going to look here and there with the garland, but ultimately find Ramchandra there. Durba Adala Ram. But going to give in a garland to in a Ramchandra. But Ramchandra is very tall figure. So Sita Devi waiting. Ramchandra not in a Ramchandra he bent, then Sita Devi can, but not, cannot keep. There is some nice discussion there. Ramananda Sadhu, those who are authentic, Ramayana Baba, they used to speak. Then Lakshman watching the case situation. I mean, Sita Thakurani, 
Sita Devi cannot give garland to Ram. Ram is a tall figure. <laughs> you know, like in the old age, like in the old age, our Gadadhar Pandit cannot give garland to Gopina. Gopina then sit and <laughs> sit down. <laughs> Gadadhar Pandit in old age bent up. They cannot give garland. My Guru Maharaj also in the old age cannot give garland. You can give. <laughs> so this way, Ramchandra not going to take. Then Lakshman immediately coming to touch the lotus feet of Ramchandra. Whenever Lakshman going to touch, then Ram, uh, touch the lotus feet of Ramchandra, Ramchandra speaking, Oh my brother, what you are doing? Okay? Going to bend and then give the garland. This way marriage was done. There is a big history. After that, I don't like to go in details. All the way, total Ram Lila, total Ram Lila. When Ramchandra was sent to exile, because without exile, without exile, but Lila cannot get complete form, because it has to be there. Without exile, if, if it is one kind of, you know, Siddhanta Bichara, you are already going to Ram. In Ram Lila, Ram Lila Tattva Siddhanta. Maybe tomorrow or day after tomorrow you can publish. You can read. There actually it's, it's a must. Because without going to exile, how the Lila can take place? Ramchandra. It's one. It. So this way, Ramchandra purposely, there is so secret Siddhanta. Going to exile. Sita Devi, I can also go. Well, you can go. Lakshman say, I can also go. So if they are not going, who can do Leela? Sita Devi is there. I've been there in the place. I mean, four, five years back, I went to speak Harikatha there in Dandakarana. At present, there is the border of Urisha and MP. I went there four, five years back to speak Harikatha there. And they take me in their car to the place where Sita was abducted. At the, I went there. Ravan abducted that place, I went. You know, there. So there, <coughs> abduction of Sita, it's one kind of Leela. <coughs> Who can abduct Sita? Mahaprabhu going to prove. Mahaprabhu going to prove in front of some Ram devotee. Mahaprabhu in South India, Mahaprabhu in South India going to prove Mahaprabhu in South India is going to prove in front of a Ram devotee, Ram devotee, Ram devotee crying, My Sita Dagurani already abducted. Our Gauranga was speaking, how possible? Sita is the internal potency of Ram. Ravan is Rakshash, you know, demon. How he can, how he can see? Well, he is crying. Then Mahaprabhu, while in South Indian trip, going to collect one page from Kurma Puran. Then to so, here is the document. When Mahaprabhu coming here, here is the document. Don't cry. Don't cry. Here is the Siddhanta in Kurma Puran. When Ravan came to abduct Sita Devi, then Sita Devi disappeared from that place. And taking shelter of Agni, fire. And Shadow Sita. Shadow Sita. Only coming. It is not actual Sita. Maya Sita. You can say Maya, Maya, Maya. So Ravan thinking, I am going to abduct Sita and going to take away. But actually, not that. It is not that. Actually, not that. How to see Mahaprabhu speaking, even Ravan, what to speak about touching Sita? What to speak about touching Sita? Even Ravan cannot see where is Sita. He is Prakita, internal potency of Ram. Huh? It's a false. Long discussion, you know, Sita Devi, how much perseverance, how much tolerance, you know, there, and the separation mood, and the, separate, and the separation mood shown by Ramchandra and Sita, all for our teachings. All for our teachings. Otherwise, Bhagavan, why he can cry? Oh, Sita, where you are? Ramchandra crying like a human being. Sita, where you are? Crying. All for our teachings. So many, if Sita is, if Sita not going to be abducted, 
if Sita, if Sita Devi is not going to be abducted by Ravan, who can kill Ravan? Ramchandra can make Leela, make a bridge, can go to Lanka with all the troops. Hanuman, all monkey, has the troops. <laughs> they are going. Shukrib, Hanumanji, Maharaj, all, <laughs> they are all full troops. They are going to invade, to attack Lanka. Follow with full enthusiastic mood. Hey, our Hanumanji Maharaj is going to burn whole Lanka. Hey, as some, 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 somebody asking, you burn whole Lanka? And so many innocent hey, Jivatma are going to die? Why you are doing? Well, I am not doing, I am not burning Lanka. I am doing Ram Seva. I am not responsible for the burning of Lanka. This is the mood of Hanumanji Maharaj. This way we will have to be very alert about Krishna Bhajan. Janvathagurani Tattva is so deep discussion I should do, but time cannot permit today. I like to draw a conclusion that without the Kipa of Janvathagurani, Ananga Manjari, we cannot get entry in Rupanuga Bhajan. Ananga Manjari, she is the is the younger sister of Radharani. Follow. So without her kipa, whole day night you have to cry. Praying unto the lotus feet of Nityananda means praying unto the lotus feet of Janavata Gurani. So to cross over this material ocean, so I started with with this sloka. Sangsar Sindhu Tarani Hidayam Jadishad. Shankirtanam Ritara Se Ramate Manosyed Premam Buddha Viharani Yudhi Chitta Bhitti Chaitanya Chanda Charane Kurutanuragam Nittananda Charane Kurutanuragam Vancha Kalpatur Sikhi Basin the Bhavish Patitanan Pavana Bhavishna Vyunam Any question you have? No? I give you answer, na? Any question you have? No question? Okay. Then if any, if you, if you have any, any personal question, then we'll have to sit with some devotee. But if you have open question, you can put in front of me, I can give answer, then I can go. Maharaj, this shadow of Sita. Oh, oh, this I can explain. Shadow means not like your shadow. In our Prakriti Jagat, shadow is also, you can, just like, Durga, Yogamaya, just like Durga. Durga is the shadow of that Yogamaya. But you can worship Durga. You can see Durga. It's like shadow. Like one example I can give. One king, big powerful king. See, he was crying. For whom? For whom? The, you know, for Apsara. Apsara mean? Uh, uh, um, Urvashi, Oilo, Oilo Raja, from Bhagavatam. Oilo, Oilo, Pururaba, foolish shop, foolish in front of foolish I am discussing. Pururaba, Oilo, Pururaba, king. Pururaba of him was crying for Urvashi. Urvashi gone? She is very clever. Enjoy for some day with Pururaba. He is a very powerful man. After that, Pur Anna, Urvashi gone. And, and the Pururava king crying, Urvasi, where you are, without you I cannot live. Then finally, those Gandharva, they are going to give some false, you know, you know, sh shadow of Urvasi. It is not actually Urvasi. It is like Urvasi. Someday he is playing with Urvasi. After that discover, oh my God, it is not actually Urvasi. So, shadow or? In Aprakit Yoga, not like your shadow and my shadow. It's not a jiva. Eh? It's not a jiva. Not a jiva. So, Vancha Padru. You have any question, Mataji? I heard you have some question. Then you can put question. I can give answer. Otherwise, you are busy also. You have to go to Krishna Nagar here, there. When one arrives in Vardam, what is the procedure? I cannot hear. You hear properly. A long time. What is the reason? Use it. 
Duty, Acha. Your duty is to hear Harikatha, do Sankirtan with devotees. Because whole life we are getting Asa Sangha. We are not getting Prophet Sangha, na? If you get the symptom that you are getting Satsangha, 100%, means you can get green signal. You can get 100%. From your heart, if you are getting Satsangha, that means green signal. Nobody can stop you. But the fact is that we are not usually in your life, you are staying there outside long distance, usually you are not going getting satsanga, but you are doing satsanga through Harikatha. Mentally you are doing, na? So mentally and physically, for bonded soul, for bonded soul, it is the approval. It is the approval of our Guru Bhargava. It is the approval of our Guru Bhargava for bonded soul, both physically and mentally, both satsanga. Not that you are staying long distance in America, so what to do, Maharaj? My Guru Maharaj gone, Prabhupada gone, Kesab Maharaj gone, Shanto Maharaj gone, Siddhar Goswami Maharaj gone. I can cry? Where are they gone? I can get their association, na? If they are not going to give me association, how I can speak Harikatha? I cannot manufacture Harikatha in my, good, in my in a factory. So that's when Satsanga there. So in your life also, for a long time you are staying there, what to do? It is the arrangement of Bhagavan, any condition if you stay, you have to be happy, okay. But you go on hearing Harikatha, your duty is to hear Harikatha continuously and remember, not only hearing, after taking so much, you know, so much rich food, you are taking so much prasadam, paramana, kichiri, all everything, but you cannot digest, then big problem. So if you are hearing Harikatha, repeatedly you have to chew, chew, you know, like Gomata, first at a time taking, after the seeing, chewing. You have to remember all Harikatha, from heart you will have to bring outside, again remember, again think, sometime you can arrange one group meeting, sometime you can come here, get together, you can put question to him, he can put question to you, what is the, uh, what is the, what is your realization power? You can put question to him. He can put question to you. This way, all exchange of view, satsang you can do. Maybe weakness is there. This way, we'll have to grow. I can never prescribe you to sleep for 10 hours. I'm not foolish. But this is your, this is your medicine. What to do? This is the only medicine. I can never prescribe. Whereas I am taking rest four hours, how I can ask you, you can tell, you know? But this is a medicine. So, you will have to depend upon Nityananda, Janavata Kurani. Some medicine must come in your life, you can revive. So, non-stop satsanga. Try to follow what I say. Not that in the morning time, uh, I was hearing Harikatha, oh, almost two hours, not that. I mean to say, Continuous, non-stop, uninterrupted satsanga can give success in your life. Follow what I say. The reason for why you are coming is this, nothing else. Shiva doesn't mean eh, you can arrange big bandara, this is not there. You can go on doing. Wastage of money you cannot do, you can go on hearing Harikatha. If you at all your inspiration coming, well, I can do this seva for publication, this, that. Our Bengali Katha Center going on. There sometimes we can add in some small bandara because here no place. We have no, all temple, I think my temple. But the situation you know. So this way you can get together sometime or if you grow some question again, you can put in front of me. You go on doing bhajan. If you do bhajan, if you hear Harikatha, surely question can come. If question not coming, that's why you are not doing bhajan. <laughs> Our teachers in boyhood used to stay in school. You are not putting question, that's why you are foolish, idiot. Not reading properly. <laughs> reading means you are allowed to put question. So this way you can put question. Don't feel alone. 
If you feel alone, this is one kind of disease, chronic disease. Why are you alone? You are not alone. You are alone? Why well, this kind of disease? Who told you you are alone? You are not alone. Always feel that you are with Guru Varga. Huh? Okay, today, uh, any other question you can write down in your paper and I can give, surely I can give answer. Okay? I'm very happy that you come from long distance. <laughs> to best to keep on me. Krishna Das' mother, she also like to come to bless me <laughs> from long distance. Eh? Oh, very happy. At least for one time, Maharaj, I say, why? Why one time? You can live for a long time. <laughs> she is crying and speaking. At least for Maharaj, one time I like to see her, like to see, you know, one time. Now, why one time? Why not? Many times. So, 